Okay, welcome to the next part of Delta Room. We are last time I got completely fucking ass raped by the the king of clubs. So yeah, that happened. And this time I'm going to try and ass rape him. Actually, I got to take a piss. So let's artificially inflate the video runtime. Woo! Alright, I'm back. Let's see, is it recording everything well? Yeah, it seems to be. Uh, so there's a problem. It, OBS seems to not be picking up, not picking up the audio at all. Maybe there is. Okay, yeah, there seems to be audio now. Hey, there's Lance. Oh, hey, there's Lancer. Okay, I already know this whole cutscene. We've seen this. Do I have to go through this cutscene every time? Anyway, yeah, uh, let's just skip through this. Eh. There we are. And then he's like, it's nice to meet you. And then it's like, Lancer, Lancer, my son. Yeah, you fucked up. Yeah, no. And then he grabs him. He's like, puts it on his shoulder. But now he's grabbing him. And then they're like, yeah, fuck off. And then he's like, I'll fuck, I'll drop him off the building if you don't shut the fuck up. And then they're like, Let's get down and not shut. Let's shut the fuck up. And then he's like, "Fuck you, dad. I'm out." And then they're like, "Okay, yeah, let's fuck his dad." Like so our kid said to do. And now we're trying to fuck his dad. But he kind of looks all autism. Alrighty. So I kind of know what's going on here. So first, what we want is to talk with this and uh, do that. So he tries to raise me with the king. Lance, my friend, so if we get through without hurting you then, and then he's like, oh, fuck, uh, if I die, it's cool. Show them the monster you really are. And then she, she's like, all right, you, I'll do what you want. And then, yeah. So, how dare you come here, Lightners? Okay, yeah, that's just... All he really does is, like, clubs and, like, club-themed attacks. Now I want to act as uh, Rolse and have Susie attack. Rousey tried to reason with the king. You might not realize it, but this is the world where you don't have to fight it. I know if we try, we can all find another way. Such simple-minded platitudes. A shame you will not live to realize your naivete. Now perish with the pathetic lightners you worship. Sorry, my friends and I aren't going anywhere. Rousey's will is changing. Talk with King Dual Heal. You left uh, that uh, you you that left us in the shadows, stripped of meaning. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Here we go! Whoa! And then a whoa! And then a whoa! Up! And then a hump! We gotta build those tension points, am I right? And of course, we talk for ourselves. Silence, Lightbringer! Your very existence goes against our own. By the night's will, I will shatter your heart to pieces. Your will is changing. Talk with courage. Oh, yeah. You dare return to torment us once again. This guy's clearly evil, so I have no regrets to trying to murder him. So, yeah. I 
I really like the new battle system. Be gone, we have found a fresh purpose. All right. 60. It's 60 tension for that, okay. For the night has appeared. Oh shit, here we go. Yonk, and then a bonk, and then a shit, and then a shunk, and then an ass, and then, okay. Okay, here we go, Red Buster! And then, yeah. your soul shined its power on Susie! Susie, this Red Buster! <laughs> I'm not sure if the audio is getting through, so I'm just making the sound effects for you. Oh, I really missed that one. The knight that pulls the fountains from the earth. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. Gonna eat a donut. It's gonna taste really good. About to give this guy's ass. He's stupid. Oh, fuck. Shit. Uh, it only heals 10. Whatever. Holy fountains whose shadows are creating a new world. Our world. Whatever, this guy's a total freaking dingle. This guy's like 100% a dingle. It's not cool. Okay. Oh, do you see oh, our new purpose? Whatever, you dingle. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Holy ass. Okay, Rousing needs healing. Maybe I can have, uh, have, have him dual heal. Oh, he doesn't heal himself. Oh, wait. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Soon this world shall be blanketed in darkness, and darkness shall rule. Whatever you say, fucking fago. Cytosis. King's Mouse gives a berserk smile. Ralsei can eat the re revivement? Okay, I guess Ralsei can't eat anything. I'll say, then you may see what it is like to live in despair. <laughs> Your soul shined its power on today. Bad Buster! Oh, is he finally now? Now enough talk. Fall before the chain of justice! Oh, this is getting kind of scary. Oh, poop! Oh, poop! King's cape flutters weakly. You mean the king of clubs? Ha, you're quite strong, aren't you? Can we, like, just not kill him? Because, like, damn. What's our last check? Okay. Okay, well, why don't we finish him off with a Red Buster? I don't know. Seems pretty sweet. Red Buster! Okay, Rousey, you gonna finish him off? If I keep farting you like this, then... He's gonna die! How spooky. Alright. Oh, there we go. <laughs> one hit one hit from Rousey killed... Uh, actually, then... I see. You are much stronger than I envisioned. Lightness, I... Perhaps I have been too cruel. The truth is, I was not always this way. There once was a time where darkness and lightness lived in harmony. A time where darkness could... So there's, like, different types of monsters, too. Okay. A time where darkness could fulfill their purpose in peace. It would be a lie to the... Okay, so it's, like, humans... And then there's monsters. So humans and monsters are light. And then there's a subclass. There's like an even lower class of monster. That's called a darkener. Okay. Uh, it would be a lie to say that. Here, I too do not yearn for those days. Is he gonna die? Do we get execution points? Perhaps you young ones are right. Please, let us put away our weapons. There must be a peaceful solution to all this. Uh, dot, dot, dot. Kill now, Susie. 
He's gonna fucking wreck us all. I'm glad you're starting to realize, Mr. King. None of us really want to fight. If you can just tell us about your worries, I'm sure we can all be friends, Mr. King. Yes, friends. That sounds lovely. You... <coughs> My apologies, I am... Um, I'm not used to fighting like that. My body is getting weak. Oh, don't say another word. Or else he's gonna die, or else he's gonna... You should be all healed up. How do you feel? Let's see. Yep. Fucking called it never better. You. Did I say you could get up? Oh, shit, I have a shield. Chris. Oh, spare me the heroics. Oh, shit. What's going on here? You, you're the leader, aren't you? So what's your plan? To laugh as you cast us all back into obscurity? You can't even say. Young one, let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me Oh, shit! Oh! <laughs> you know who that reminds me of. <laughs> Hi. Get away from my friend. <laughs> what? Surely you must realize how exhausted I am, Lightner. Any hit from you would kill me. Why not do it, Lightner? Kill me and show my son how much you really care. Nah, nah. So what's your plan, then? To talk me to death? <laughs> it's got a point. I mean, you stupid, stupid Lightner. You honestly think that you have any way to convince me not to kill you? Just wait a second. Wait, for what? Huh? Why am I suddenly sleepy? Why do you, you little, you sweet little pumpkin? Hey, crazy, you alright? That was close, Susie. I'm surprised you remembered my pacify spell. Like, mom. I'd never forget something I made fun of before. Chris, Susie, I'm sorry. Because I healed the king, we almost... We almost... Susie, you were right. I... I was foolish to think we could act so soft to everyone. This isn't a world where kindness always wins, is it? It's complicated. Yeah, sometimes there's people you just gotta fight. But if you never let your guard down, then... You might let just hurt someone you care about, too. Everyone, you're okay! I'll answer, hey! Sorry, I kind of beat up your dad. That's okay, it happens. Oh, it even looks like he's having he's having a beauty nap. That's good, he seems cranky. Man, you can say that again. Lancer, what's that noise? Oh, I actually came to warn you, clownlings. I informed the guys you were fighting my dad, but... Instead of eagerly volunteering you to help, everyone just caught the freak out. Now they appear to be, um, breaking through the door to the throne room. Well, well, that's not the best. Chris, Susie, it seems that you must hurry to the fountain. No time for goodbyes, huh? Yes, of course, no goodbyes. We're bad guys, so we only have bad guys. Nice. Huh, <laughs> you've learned a lot, huh? Only from the best of the, of the worst. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, I'll stop the door. Later, dude. Susie, Chris, if we must say goodbye, then... Um, I... I just wanted to say... I really enjoyed meeting you two, and... Like, uh, can you stop mumbling into your hat for a sec? We can barely hear you, dude. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, shit! Um, Chris, Susie, I... I hope I can see you again soon. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cakes, alright? Holy shit, is that like... More goats? Oh yeah, sure, dude. <laughs> Let's go, Chris. Damn. Let's get the fuck out of here. Is this the fountain? Don't know how, but 
it feels like we stumbled into something really important, didn't we? Well, there's no time to think about that now. Uh, right now, it's time to go home. Right, Chris? As you stood in front of the fountain, you felt something strange. It was as if your very soul- Oh shit! And I have a red soul, that's determination. Alphys and Undyne were only there for like. Look, Alphys was there for like a minute. Undyne was only there for like three seconds. Toriel was there for like two minutes. This, this doesn't feel like. Well, I mean, it feels like Undertale. It feels a lot like Undertale, but it doesn't feel like a sequel. Hey, watch it. It feels like a. like a spin off. Huh? The unused classroom. How do we get here? What the fuck? Hey, Chris. What? What just happened? <laughs> like, that wasn't a dream or anything. Was it? <laughs> that was not a dream. That was a fucking game. Anyway, as I was saying, let's just tell Alph Alphys we couldn't find any chalk. The door is locked. We just went to the fucking underground! It's a light switch. <laughs> Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. Guess Alphys will know better than to ask us next time, huh? Dot, dot, dot. Well, guess we should go. See you later, I guess. Chris? Let's go back there tomorrow, right? What the fuck? Let's bring the whole fucking class back there tomorrow. Door's locked. Alright. The door's locked. Alright, well. It's a computer. The desktop wallpaper is you and your brother just up for Halloween. You and your brother? Oh! <sighs> Miss Toriel. That's so, that's so, uh, what the fuck's the word? Wholesome! Yeah. Lockers. L locker, it's locked. Haha, <laughs> I get it. Here's Alphys' classroom. The computer's turned off. Everything felt peaceful for a moment. Well, is the background, like, Metaton? You? Undyne? I guess Undyne. Chris, whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worry sick. Chris, I'm afraid I'm going to have to punish you. Huh? A friend? You were spending time with a friend? Chris, I'll make an exception this time. Did this guy never have friends? You gotta explain to this chick that you just went to the underground, saw someone of her own race. Okay, well, let's fucking go to the library. Oh, hey, Tim. It's Tim. Gotta go to college, so Tim study hard! He's reading a comic full of hot demon guys. Chris, what's up? Cat is working, so I'm starting on our project. I've already copied a bunch of pictures. It's the same picture of a soccer ball 733 times. Chris, you survived Susie. I was getting worried. Now you can finally pay off your family debt. How to draw dragons is 700, 2,583 days overdue. However, Chris, I am a benevolent volunteer assistant. If you turn it in this week, I'll reduce your fight to a mere $64. I love reading books, especially the books upstairs. You should really read them. Get out of the fucking way. Seems like it's making a game. What, what, seems like when the game's finished, you can go in. You just have to trust the dog. When the game's finished, I can go in, huh? I don't remember that. Alright. Oh, hey, it's Undyne. Undyne! Hey, punk, get out of the road! You're blocking the traffic! 
Oh, wait, it's just Asgore's kid. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little uh, worked up lately. There's nothing to stop. I'm so bored. Nothing ever happens in this town. Mm, I just wish something would shake things up. Shut the fuck up. Sh I want to rub the bank so I can suplex them. Wait, do we even have a bank? Hey, get someone to build a bank! <laughs> Police Chief Undyne is surprised, supposed to be directing traffic, but all she's doing is standing in the middle of the street, yelling, get out of my way. She's the best time. I really feel directed. How am I supposed to get past this blue lady? I am stuck. I guess I should just run away. Hospital. Oh, it's you. Are you here to play the piano again? The patients can't hear it well from here, but I personally enjoy it. Let's go. It's an obligatory hospital piano shrunk to fit in the corner. corner. As a result, it's missing most of the good keys. Play it? Yes. Plink. Can I go further into the hospital? This way. This castle's white wizards relegated me to this healing chamber, but my blood is boiling for battle! Whatever. Ah ha ha, dad, I just can't... I can't just say that to her. Oh my god, I'd die. I'd literally die. Noelle, sweetheart, first time I laid eyes on your mother, I walked right up and told her she was a hot piece of work. Really? Yeah, she slapped me so hard I blacked out. Ha ha ha, dad, that doesn't help at all. Anyhow, House Dragon Blazers 3 beat it yet? No, nah, I'm still at the Ice Palace. I've been kind of, kind of waiting to finish it with you, dad. Noel, I'm going to die. Dad, I'm actually going to die. <laughs> Fine, you win. I'll bring it next time. Oh, it's getting late. Guess I better go. I've got homework. Oh, that's the group project voice. Bird guy again. What's his name? Nerdly. It's Birdly. He's not that bad, dad. I'll kick his ass. Haha, <laughs> dad, you're not even supposed to get up. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Goodbye, Dad. Bye. I'm going to die. Dude, get out of my way. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Well, jingle my gosh darn bells. Looks like it's looks like Christmas came early. All right, Chris, just give me that straight shot. Why Why are you here? Did your mom make you come here? No. Really? You've grown up a lot, Chris. I'm proud of you. It wasn't long ago you were just the creepy kid next door. <laughs> now you're the creepy kid right in front of me. I fucking hate you. Okay, wait, seriously, you want to chat or something? Family. Chris, even if we've grown apart, after all, me and Mathur were college pals, right? Oh, hey, now that Ashley was off to college, you think he's doing any crazy parties like me and your dad? Hey, I'm just pulling your leg. Your dad was no party animal. Your mother, on the other hand, oh, shit! She'd always fuss about going, but once the party started, oh, fuck. She me clear it. You'd wait. That, why would you waste su such a good pie? Key lime pie is the best pie. Fight me. Oh, well, pumpkin pie is actually the best pie. Fight me. Again. Town hall. Who's the. Is it Asgore? Excuse me, dumbass. Hey, short stuff. Would you possibly. Why would you possibly need to talk to the mayor? Your allowance too low? Short stuff. That's what the cops are for. What? Don't talk to you like you're a kid. Fine. If you need someone to change your diaper, go ask the cop. Shut the fuck up, ass! Fucking ass. Dude's a dick fart. I'm sorry, the mayor's busy. If you need to see her, please tr try causing some terrible crisis. The mayor's charisma is about zero. No, it's negative. But she works hard and has a good track. Hmm, who is the mayor? Can I, uh, see who the mayor is, please? Thank you! Who the fuck are you? Chris, what a pleasant surprise to see you here on a school day. There must be a reason that you came here at such a time. I, Father Alvin, implore you, if you have anything weighing your mind, please speak. Fruit juice. Chris, if you want some of our sick fruit juice, you should come to a service. Our choir sounds a bit thinner since your brother went away. Chris, it would be wonderful. Where's Frisk? You didn't participate to an extent. Instead of just trying to drink the fruit juice. Am I... My, no. Couldn't be Chara. Kara. Fuck, I don't even know character. I don't know how to pronounce it. Gerson Booms Memorial Bench. Okay, he. Let's see who died. Gerson, renowned historian, author, and teacher. Crystal, a snowy gemstone for a proud mother. Oh shit! Wonder, a big bone for the leader of the pack. 
Shira! Oh my god! That's like... Shiren's older sister, right? I don't know, all I know is poor Shiren, because that's like a thing. Where the fuck, where am I going? Where am I going? Where's Sans? It's locked. Where's Sans? Where's Papyrus? I want to have quirky spaghetti fun time. I've been saying this this whole time. Where's the quirky spaghetti fun time? Okay. Let's go left. Police. Let's see. Is it... You knock on the door. Papyrus has to be there. So you tell me Papyrus isn't a police guy? <laughs> Simply read its fucking anger. Just like actually insane anger. Okay. Dinner. F fucking. I know it was a diner. It was just a. Okay. Where is Sans? I see pizza. Pizza. What the fuck is going on? I'm getting out of this. I'm getting. <laughs> that, that doesn't seem like a very fun zone. There he is! Hey, look at who's walking around! How are you, kid? Do I see? Great to see you again. Hey, yeah, it's real nice, isn't it? Especially considering I've never met you before. <laughs> the name's Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm new in town. What's up? We just moved here, so I hardly know anyone. Why well, I got anyone I should know better? My mom! Your mother, huh? Too late. I already befriended your mom. <laughs> she's great. Came to the store to buy chocolate kisses. Said she's got a locker door to stop you from eating them. <laughs> you sound like a fun kid, huh? Forest Papyrus. There he is. Okay, my teacher. Alphys, yeah, I know about her. Came into the store with a suitcase and sunglasses. Thought she was part of the mob. She opened the case and stuffed it full of instant noodles. Pins mobiles. Then slunk out of the place. Pajamas trolling on the floor. Anyway, our relationship is uh, purely business. So I guess I'll just let her do her thing. What's up, friends? So I already know anyone. Why I got anyone I should know better. Me! Hello there, tiger. You can't just jump straight into friendship. It takes time. Alright, that's enough time. Take this. Call it whenever you feel like. What's up? Store. Behind me? Yeah, that's the grocery store. Unfortunately, it's closed. What a pain. I really wanted to buy some milk. So I'm not a complaint to the guy who runs it. Is that is that not you? Okay. Hey bud. Are you busy tomorrow? I need some help with something. It'd be great if you could come over. I live just next door! You know? Yes, I know. Wow, you were del del deliberating for a while. Gee, what's wrong? Don't want to hang out with a stranger? Well, I guess I shouldn't complain. Uh, what are we going to be doing? Oh, I'm not going to be there. That'd be weird. It's just going to be you and my little brother. Ah! You need friends. Thanks. <laughs> Squeak. Knock, knock, knock. The, there was a distant trousel of bones? No response, but the distant trousel of bones. How... Okay, how far am I... Okay, 30 minutes. Okay, I'm gonna end the episode here next time on Luke Grumps.